Hey guys, how you doing? Uh, welcome to another edition of Talking uh, Cryptozoology. Um, I have just a quick video. Um, I actually been keeping up with the the information, all the stuff that was coming out with uh, Rick Dyer's uh, Friday fly-in, that all the people that are actually gonna fly in and 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 view the body. Um, uh, the people that actually were gonna view the body, they are from Team Tracker. All of the people that actually went and. Um, the two uh, press people that actually went to go view the body, they actually had to sign a press embargo that they're not allowed to say any information of at what's you know going to happen till Rick Dyer gives the okay. Um, basically, um, what I think is, uh, I I was just wondering why you know he didn't get anybody outside his own organization. I'm not here to call anybody up. A hoaxer or anything like that. I, uh, I'm just out here just to, you know, that I want to find out the truth. You know, I just want to know whether, you know, there was a Bigfoot shot or, you know, there wasn't a Bigfoot shot. That's that's my whole thing. You know, I'm not uh, trying to be a hater to anybody. You know, um, as a matter of fact, uh, I've been following this story quite a bit, and uh, there's so many, so much information coming out of this. Um, Rick was talking uh, on his hangout that um, um, that uh, they're, the, the scientists are actually going to be the ones that are going to be the ones that post the, the the DNA study of the what it, what it actually is if it has any human characteristics or not. And um, he was also um, talking, and they were also talking about. Um, how the scientists actually um, cured it because it's not in a, a freezer at all. The body's actually um, on a on a table, and it's uh, it's um, you, you know, like the, the the scientists can actually you know do whatever kind of studies they're actually doing to it. Um, he also had said uh, to many of us, uh, you know, we call it a Bigfoot bit. Um, they're actually um, uh, gathering up the. The scientific uh, of what it actually really is, whether it's a uh, whether it's a uh, some type of a cousin or you know, it has to do anything with a Gigantopithecus or it has any ape qualities uh, like Gigantopithecus or is it what kind of human characteristics it has? Uh, they're actually going to you know be able. They're going to be the ones that are going to actually you know give out the scientific evidence uh, when it actually comes out. Um, uh, the other thing that um, he was also talking about was uh, about jo Dr. Jeff Meldrum. Uh, uh, that, uh, he said he never invited him to go out there. Um, that Facebook finding Bigfoot was the one who uh, had uh, told him to go out there, but you know he never had the consent of going out there and uh, the, uh, uh, Rick never said this that uh, they that 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 he had wanted this but um, Dr. Jeff Meldrum was actually asking um, uh, he actually was charging him to go out there you know you know to I guess to see his research or whatever you know uh, they uh, uh, Facebook finding Bigfoot actually um, uh, cut him a check for fifteen thousand dollars and um, that, that's kind of ridiculous to me, you know, because like uh, Rick said, you know, I'm on, why would uh, anybody want any kind of money when he's actually doing them the favor by going out there and, you know, looking at the find of a century, you know. Uh, you know, all, all this time that, you know, I've been researching this, uh, you know, this uh, case and stuff, um, I've been actually, you know, wanting to go out to the location and I'm eventually going to go out to the location and, uh, and do some studies out there uh, to see if there's any Bigfoot activity or anything like that at the area in San Antonio. Um, you know, I, I'm still skeptical about, you know, where uh, the Bigfoot was shot, you know. Uh, sometimes I think maybe it wasn't shot in that actual location in San Antonio.
that's something that, you know, that's my own theory, you know. I think Rick shot it in, in San Antonio, but I really don't think it was shot in that exact area where they actually said it was shot. Uh, uh, I'm not here to call Rick Dyer a liar or anything like that, you know. Uh, you know, I, I'm really hoping he really does have a big foot because I really want, you know, it to come out, you know. Can you imagine all the things that it's going to benefit, you know. All these other tales of, you know, Loch Ness Monster and, and Chupacabra and stuff that we're going to be able to, you know, say, hey, well, you know, Bigfoot was discovered. And so that'll actually help out a lot of different uh, theories and different types of cryptozoology things, you know. Um, I, I have never um, wanted, I'm not, I'm not the type of person to be a hater to anybody, you know. Um, I'm just here, you know, doing my little stories, my little blogs, um, f for the name of, uh, yes, research, you know, I, I want to find out what's going on, you know, I want to, I want to, you know, see different things and, you know, find out different things about, you know, these, uh, creatures, you know what I mean, it's, it's, it's just a very exciting field, you know, to actually really think of, you know, all the different discoveries that we might find after Bigfoot if, if you know, Rick Dyer actually really shot a Bigfoot. Um, well, thank you very much, and uh, I appreciate this time, and um, if you like this video, please subscribe. Thank you. Bye-bye.